How to manage the budget and get fundings? We all would like to live in a world where we didn't need to have money to do things, right? Well, unfortunately, it is not this one. But I am going to help you get through this. First, the expenses. There are some financial resources that we will need in order to cover the expenses of the STEAM Academy. First, of course, good, clean and fair food. Traveling, expenses for the visits and to go to the venue and to get to the venue. Spaces for the group to gather and work together, but also to eat and cook. Accommodation, if the meet is take longer than one day. Don't worry, no one will expect a jacuzzi and a golden sink. You can look for economic options such as youth hostels or maybe camping. Speakers. Take into account that not all of them will be able to donate their time and knowledge to the Sin Academy. Coordination. Organizing the Sin Academy is a lot of fun and a lot of work. Depending on the format, it can take from 2 to 40 hours a week to organize the program. We recommend having a group of people working in the organization, but if you are alone, make sure you have enough people supporting you in a practical and emotional way. So far, you heard about all the expenses, but don't panic. There are also good ways of finding the resources to find a Sphin Academy. Partners. Finding partners is always a very good way of neutralizing costs. You can find people ready to donate spaces, food, time, or knowledge to the Academy. Try to approach, for instance, public organizations, municipalities, small or medium-sized producers. Crowdfunding. You can start an online or offline crowdfunding campaign, telling people about your project and what you need to make it come true. There are different platforms you can check online. Participants fee. Asking participants to pay a fee might not always be possible in all contexts around the world. In this case, Try a solidarity fee, in which everyone pays according to their possibilities, or you can offer waivers to people that cannot afford. Donors. Donors are usually bigger organizations like foundations or other charities that are willing to spend money without expecting something in return. These are very rare to find, so don't invest much time in finding them, but keep your eyes open. Calls for proposals. Organizations all over the world publish regularly openings for funding projects. If you don't have experience, it might be difficult to even understand the process. So it is not the easiest option to start with. Be aware that you will have to plan the time for the fundraising, which is a job in itself. So don't put much pressure on you. You can start with a very simple version of the Sphin Academy and build upon it. It doesn't have to be perfect the first time and nobody will be expecting this. So when, when you are ready to start your academy, you are also ready to promote it. We will help you with this in video 6.